uh, defense, start on defense end, and uh, you know, that led the offense for us. I think we got some stops and got in transition, and we just playing basketball. No, we definitely see what we're capable of as the bench unit, but, you know, uh, just got to be more consistent with it. You know, we have our nights where, you know, we don't play well, so we got to just keep playing like this and keep stepping it up. And I want to start young players like you not being able to play. What do you see from Joe? Uh, Zeke been growing over this whole season. You know, I think he's starting to get comfortable out there on the floor. You can tell by the way he's playing, shooting the ball well. He's rebounding well. Uh, he's just doing a great job in Bones. Just the energy he played with last. I mean, tonight, uh, we need him to do that every night. What's it like playing alongside Jonas Isaac, uh, that second unit that you play with? Uh, he's fast, you know, so uh, he picks up the pace for us. You know, the first group a little slower than us, so you know, when we get out there, we know we got to run. Uh, it does a lot. I told him uh, at least three or four games ago, the way he's been playing and leading, uh, just running the team. You know, he's been doing a great job of that, directing players, and you know, uh, he's just making plays, getting to the lane and making plays. And uh, we need him to continue to do that. Man. He just solid, you know, he come in, work every day, he's quiet, he's a good kid. And uh, you know, all that hard work paying off for him, so I'm happy for him. Mike, from the long haul of you being like the head of the second unit and then under an extension of Ron Hodge, mm -hmm. do you feel that way? I mean, is it hard to feel that way? You know, you didn't play last game, you played this game, you kind of can tell it, but mm -hmm. is it hard to feel that way? No, I mean, uh, I know myself, I know my role, so when I get out there, I know I got to bring that energy, you know, and that keeps me going, getting me going, so. Just got to continue to play that way. And just starting, how, how do you approach this big trade deadline coming up in a couple of days? Uh, I don't even think about it. You know, uh, I'm still getting paid, man. First and the 15th, so I'm happy. <laughs> Is that how the pro and the vet coach, how Pat will approach it? I mean, I'm not sure. I mean, for me, myself, I, you know, I don't. I mean, it's basketball at the end of the day. It's the business. But it, I guess, Antonio, how much do you want? I mean, I'm assuming you want to be here mm -hmm. and Oh, most definitely. You know, uh, since I've been here, we haven't been a, a full, healthy team. You know, and um, I think once we get to that, I think we'll be a scary team. You know, got so much power and we got so much talent on this team that it'll be hard to beat. Obviously, Evan, I know you've had an impact on the point tonight. Do you feel like your value is beyond the box score, uh, just in terms of who you are in the locker room? Oh, most definitely. I mean, this is the NBA, so... But people got to, what they fail to realize is that you have scores, you have people that do certain things on the team, you know, to keep the team going. So uh, I know my calling. Coach, when you pull, pull the curtain back, what do you do? I just play hard. I'm the glue guy, you know. Go out there, make sure I play with energy, uh, get stops, rebounds, knock down shots, and just move. You know, um, I just play off energy. Did, did you feel like you had something to prove? Um, no, I just controlling what I can control. I mean, it's, a, uh, it's out of my hand at the end of the day, so when my name gets called, I just got to go out there and do what I do. Uh, what about behind the scenes that you don't see? Are there any conversations you have in the locker room like, I always keep pulling bones aside at the end mm -hmm. of the year? Like, what do you kind of elaborate? What can you do behind the scenes that no one will ever see? Oh, uh, man, bones is a little bro. You know, he's funny, man. You know, uh, just always laughing and joking, but uh, it's a family on the, on the, on the back side. I mean... You know, you have your, your problems, you have your fights and everything, and every family, but it's a good family in there. You know, it's a brotherhood, so um, it's really no negativity like that. So, you know, it's just always next man step up. Uh, what's it like going through that fight? Man, <laughs> you know, just, um, yeah, I, I just feel like there's so much talent on this team that everybody on the team has to control what they can control because um, we loaded the guard position, you know, we we kind of slim in the at the at the uh, at the bids, but you know we're making it work.